Hi friends, my name is Raj and you are watching TechWide. So in this video, I will show you how to fix this startup repair error or you can say automatic repair error or if you are getting any kind of blue screen restart issue on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 laptop. In this video, I will show you how to fix this issue completely. So first, you have to open your laptop in advanced repair option like this. These are the advanced repair option. If you are unable to see or unable to find advanced option on your laptop, I will put a video link in description box which will help you to open your advanced option on your laptop. So in this video, I will show you three methods to fix this issue completely. So let's start with our first method. First go to the troubleshoot option, then go to advanced option, then click on command prompt. Okay. now. Enter a command chk dsk space slash f space slash r space c colon. This command will repair hard disk related issue on your laptop. So type this command and press enter. This command is run in 5 stages. So it will take around 10 to 15 minutes to complete. So I will fast forward this video. Now it's done. Now enter the second command. SFC space slash scan now. So this command will repair or remove all the windows corrupted files. So type this command and press enter. So this command will take around 4 to 5 minutes to complete. Now it's done. Now enter the last and the final command. Bootrack space slash fix MBR. So this command will fix Windows MBR file. So type this command and press enter. And you can see completed successfully. Now exit. Now choose the first option continue. So this is our first method. If you are still getting the same issue, let's move on to our method to open advanced option again, then go to troubleshoot, then go to advanced option. Now select startup settings. So this option will help you to open your laptop in safe mode. So then click on restart. Now click F5 function key to open your laptop in safe mode. Now you can see your laptop is open in safe mode. So if you recently installed any software or any game or any windows update and after that you are getting this blue screen error. So first uninstall that software. Now open control panel. If your search bar is not working and you are unable to open the control panel, what you have to do is open any folder, then go to the address bar and type here control panel and you can see the option of control panel, click on it. Now change view by small icon, then go to program and feature. And you can see the software. So if you recently install any software and that caused you to this blue screen error, uninstall that software. You can filter it by date wise. Or if you recently install any windows update manually and that caused you this blue screen error. Go to this view install updates. And then uninstall that windows update. So this is how you can uninstall recently installed software or windows update which cause you the blue screen error. 
now restart your laptop and check and if you are still getting the same issue let's move on to a third step open advanced option again then go to troubleshoot now choose the first option reset this pc so in this method we are going to reset the laptop so you have two options keep my files and remove everything if you choose the second option it will remove all your data and all your software but we will choose the first option it will keep our files safe so choose the first option keep my files then click on the second option local reinstall so now you can see all the important information that your data will remain safe your windows setting will come back in the default mode but your software will remove all the software will remove but your data will remain safe and it will reinstall a window on your device so now click on reset and the process has been started so i will fast forward this video So window is reset and you can see all the data is remain safe my files and folder are remain safe so these are the three method you can apply to fix the startup repair or a blue screen error on your windows 10 or windows 11 so thank you thanks for watching tech have a nice day